folks. I um, just wanted to pop in and do a video real quick. Um, just a little follow-up of some earrings I made with ah, the Happy Mill that I got from Pat. That was the last uh, beauty-like video I uploaded. Um, I messed my hand. My, both of my hands are messed up, but uh, my left one is more messed up. Do you like my homemade <laughs> painter's tape and an, and an old restaurant gift card? Um, so I can't... I these this didn't get finished anyways uh, my brain's not working very well my life is complete chaos I won't go into it right now but uh, anyways so here are some fun earrings that I made with Pat's happy mail what what if I could can I hook it on my <laughs> you know, okay they don't make the best background <laughs> laugh because my life is so crazy uh just some african bead glass uh some cute little dangles from auntie's beads i uh, just did some i hear you some basic wire wrapping around the beads just some simple earrings i yeah it's just a it's just a head pin or just an eye pin made out of craft wire and a dangle super simple um it's more super simple. Um, I tried to use all the beads uh, and such, except for the findings from uh, Pat's Happy Mail. Uh, I love these. Um, these uh, uh, these splattered uh, lampwork beads with the frit on them. I think they're so cute. Um, with some, uh, got some stone. I think that's a venturine. That looks like some Indonesian beads. These might be Indonesian or uh, Indian lamp work. And again, just using like a head pin for this bottom dangle and some craft wire or uh, an eye pin. I can't tell. And I just use, I just do mixed metals anymore because I figure why not. I kind of got, got used to it over the years. I used to be anti-mixed metals. I'm hoping most of the bruises aren't showing in my hands anymore. I definitely didn't want to do a video because my hands look so bad for a while. Um, so it's been like nine days or something. I don't know. These, I love these beads. These, this is kind of a soft craft wire. Um, <laughs> it's hard to see. Uh, I love I love the beach she gave me. There's so much fun. There's cute little bells down here. Just you hear them. <clears throat> Excuse me. I had a big cough. Um. Oh my gosh, my sinuses are crazy. Can I hook them on here? Are they easier to see if they're hooked on here? <laughs> on my my wrist splints? I don't know. They're, I just love the beach she gave me. There's so much fun. I have like some ideas from some um, bracelets with the beach she gave me, but I just love how these sound. But yeah, I, uh, the, I used the wire. Oh, gosh, my sinuses. Um, the findings, um, but the beads and all that, like the dangles and all that she gave me with the Happy Mail. I just love these two, these painted beads with those little evil eye beads and some copper spacers, like some Ethiopian rondelle brass and um, some fused glass. I think those are uh, coral. Yeah. And I put these little patina dangles to match the teal and the evil eye beads. So, it had, I've had so much fun just sitting on the floor. Oh, this one, these have different, different things. Oh my goodness, how am I gonna, oh, I gotta take this off. Sorry, coughing again, my, I don't know, my histamines are not happy or something. So these are those little bells that like down here on this, these the dangles here at the bottom. I, I just used four and just strung them onto the head pin. 
so it has a little jingle but they're more firm but these beads are so much fun so I just kind of played with the pink and the blue and the green using mixed metals with kind of different ear wires hooks and this is the one I didn't get to finish oh my gosh I'm getting too hot already I have all the stuff here so I, I hadn't decided which way I wanted it to hang like this with this kind of bowed the cocoa uh, shell um, I couldn't decide which way I wanted it to hang but you know green and purple is fun with some earthy elements in there mixed metals and there's supposed to be this guy this little one that goes with it so I mean I haven't done a lot my life has been chaos and uh I've been dealing with a lot of pain and health and a separation, I'll just say it like that. <laughs> and, um, yeah, uh, I think that's all I got to say right now. I hope my hand gets better because it's a <clears throat> index finger and middle finger. I'm kind of, I kind of been sort of getting used to like picking things up like this. <laughs> But these aren't very strong either because I damaged these too. So if I put a little, if I, it, uh, I'm sweating. It hurts. Okay. Anyways, I want to say thank you, Pat, for the fun mail. Happy mail. I uh, hope to make more stuff. Um, I, I probably one of my last bead orders I will make until I figure out my financial situation. Um, is one behind me that I hopefully will do an unboxing for soon because it's a really fun Etsy store um, with some like vintage older beads. Uh, and that's it. Thank you so much for uh, watching the video and thank you for supporting my channel. And I hope in the future I can put out more fun stuff and get my life together. Um, and until then, have a wonderful day, evening, afternoon, morning, <laughs> night. <laughs>